Hello everyone. Welcome back to another video from Fun Learning with Smita. In today's tutorial video, I would be teaching you all how to compress any image or how you can reduce the file size. So many a times when you're uh, filling forms online, the, you are required to upload your digital signature or we can say your photo in a particular size. So today I'll teach you the easiest method. Within seconds or minutes, you can reduce the file size. So what you need to do is open your Google tab and type reduceimages.com over there. Once you go to that site, this is how it will look like. So over here, you have the option of selecting image. So I'll just keep this video short, brief, crisp. So I'm not exploring this uh, whole site by signing, a, uh, signing up or creating any account. So I'll click on the option select image. This is the photo which I want to convert. So you can see over here, it's 137.99 KB and you can see the it's 566 and into 800. So that is the detail of the image which I have selected. As we scroll down, they give us several op, uh, like de details over here. So we can choose a new size and format. So right now it's 70 width and 70 height. So I'll reduce it to 50. Also, whether I want it to be in percentage or pixels, if you want in pixel format, you can do so. So I'll keep it percentage right now and I'll keep it 50. The background right now, if you see of my image is white. If you want to change it to black, you can select this option. If not, keep it the same. The final format of the image which you are going to download, whether you want it in JPG, PNG and GIF. So here you cannot convert it into PDF. If you want to know how you can convert any file into PDF, you can go through other videos which I have uploaded in my channel. There are several videos where I have given a tutorial about how you can convert any file into PDF file. So I'll keep it JPG that is as it is. And over here, there's an option of quality. Now, what is this quality? As, as you reduce or increase the size of a normal image, there is a tendency that the quality of the image uh, will get worse or better. So in case you select the quality to be 100, the image would be best, but the file size would be very large. In case you select it to be 0% quality, it's going to be the ugliest image uh, but the smallest file while uh, if you just select between 70 to 90 it's going to be average so i'll keep it 90 and i'll click on the option resize so this is my resized image which is of 25.86 kb so you can see my image which was 137.99 kb has been reduced to 25.86 kb but uh, I want it within 50 KBs. So in case I want to increase, so I'll just go back over here and this 50, I'll turn it into 65. And again, I'll click on the option resize. And you can see 36.41 KB is there. So you need not download every image. You can make changes over here in terms of the percentage and then click on resize and keep checking. So it is 38.21 KB. That's perfect for me. I'll click on the option download. So it gets downloaded in my folder. Within seconds, I'll open this image. So this is my new image and I'll show you the properties. So if you see the properties, you can see that this is a JPG file which has been converted and now it's 38.2 KB. I'll just show the properties. So over here, you can see the new size is 38.2 KB and the dimension is in pixels is also given over here. So I hope this video has been useful to you all. In case you liked it, do like and share it with your friends with whom you think this would be beneficial. Thank you so much.